This is Matt Wilson with Ray Allen Manufacturing, and today we're going to talk about some new products from Rescue Essentials for your canine. The likelihood of you running into a medical versus like an apprehension or something like that's pretty high. So a local guy here in Colorado, dust off canine, but he travels pretty often. Great medical advice. Look at a lot of his stuff. He knows what he's doing. Den Mother Canine on Instagram is another great outlet to look at for when it comes to medical gear. Make sure that you guys are getting the training, but also you guys can carry some of the stuff that's very important. Uh, one of them being a canine auction mask for built actually for a dog. So if you're doing a bag valve mask, you know, for a human and anything like that, this hooks up to the bag to provide auction for a dog it's got great suction for around the dog's mouth uh, and so you guys can get them the air that they need Obviously this is kind of niche. You're gonna need a lot of training to learn it, but it's not a bad thing to carry. The second one uh, is this nifty little belt pouch. It comes with, comes with a couple different things and obviously that pops out very quickly. Some gloves, if you guys are dealing with anything like a broken leg or anything like that, that's um, blood or anything that is excrement or anything like that, you're gonna need gloves. It has a SWAT tee that comes with it. A normal tourniquet that we would use for like humans does not work on dogs. SWAT tees tend to be uh, some of the best, but again, local professionals that do this for a living, listen to them. Comes with some normal gauze and also combat gauze. So you can pack a wound. This little belt pouch sits nicely on a two inch belt. It's got a little opening um, and you can do it with molly uh, if you do a clip and molly it on a belt if you want to, but it's a great thing to have uh, in order to have those rescue essentials for your dog. One of the most important things that we brought on that I was really pushing for for a long time is a canine litter. Uh, a litter is something that is very lightweight, very packable, but if you need it, it is gonna be one of the most life-saving things for you and your dog. You are not a vet, well you might be a vet, I don't know who I'm talking to, but most of us are not veterinarians. So if your dog gets hurt, the most important thing is getting them to a vet in a timely manner. Being able to carry a dog that might have broken its leg, might have an injury to its paw pad, whatever it is that can't hike down, can't walk down from a situation, a nice light canine litter that you can have is gonna be a lifesaver for you and your dog. I used to talk about this in training, you know, a lot of people can pick up their dog and I'm like, okay, now walk a mile. They're not gonna be able to do it. Their arms are gonna give out. They might put them on their shoulders, but if they have a broken leg or something like that, you might add more injury to it. A litter like this, you're able to put your dog in it and you can have either, you know, you and another person carry it like you would see a stretcher or you connect one of our like uh, nylon service dog leashes that has a bunch of connection points and do this and put it on your back like a backpack. There's a lot of different options to this, but it's amazing tool to have to throw in a bag you know i run a i run a mystery ranch bag and um i've also ran like kafaru and arteryx and every bag they always have those zipper pouches in them these things fold up you can throw whatever you need in there and it's always a good idea to have these things with you if you're taking your dog out on an adventure out on a road trip whatever it is you need to carry some essential gear for rescue or medical to get them to a vet so you can find all of Canine Essentials rescue gear at rayallen.com. Thank you guys for tuning in today.